Hey, what's up, people of YouTube? This is Grow Me Something, Mister. It is Saturday, December 9, 2017. Welcome to Bright Idea Gardens. It's time for a fall garden update. And, um, yeah, as you saw there, we had a, um, I think they call that a freeze. We had a freeze last night, and there was that, that stuff on the ground there. Fra, fra, I think they call it frost or something like that. Um, a little dirt never hurt. Help me out with that. Is that what they call that? frost something like that in uh here in uh south louisiana don't know what that's all about but um yeah i um didn't get to cover these plants i didn't get to leave work to uh, take care of this but um whatever i think miss linda said that uh, these greens taste better after they go through a freeze or a frost so um i hope they're not messed up i haven't had a chance to actually uh, try these yet uh, but the strong winds that came through, I did have some that, um, as you can see here, they, they broke apart. They were blown over. So, um, yeah, hopefully this is not just a one-and-done kind of uh, harvest for these uh, for these greens. I did harvest some before, but uh, for me to have, I hope that uh, they're able to keep coming back uh, for more. So, anyway, this is my um, mustard bed right here. These are my cabbages, and as usual, there's always got to be one that doesn't want to play nice. This is my broccoli bed right here, and um, poor little sweet potatoes. They can't handle that cold weather. But, um, yeah, that's my broccoli bed there. I thought I had, yeah, I have a head of broccoli here coming up. We'll have that for Christmas probably. It's small, and you can see how the, uh, the wind just knocked this thing wide over. Here's an update on the pumpkin patch here. You can see it's been knocked down. It's been knocked down for a little while. And um, I was actually able to harvest here. Um, able to harvest one. It's nothing like what the Christmas garden uh, has. But, um, you know, whatever. I have it here just so I can uh, feed, it to, uh, feed it to the chickens. Here is the cauliflower bed. And uh, you might notice that, um, yeah, I got a couple of things wrapped up. Uh, you wrap these. It's called blanching because inside... Yeah, look at that. It's cauliflower. I'm going to have that for Christmas as well. Here's a little baby one here with the little baby cauliflower, so that's not going to be much of anything. But, um, yeah, I have several cauliflower that's wrapped up. And uh, basically, you blanch it just to keep it white. And um, actually, you would have kept it protected from... This is partially frozen right there, but um, it would have kept it protected from the weather. So we have one there. I have another one. Actually, a nice size one right here. That's a real nice size one. Here's my other pumpkin patch here with some little green pumpkins right there. Don't know if they're going to be uh, turning uh, orange or not, but uh, whatever. Anything that I can't feed to the girls, I'll just uh, feed the compost. Speaking of which, there's my compost right there with the rotted pumpkin. Uh, that one wasn't that good, so I couldn't give it to the girls. A little sleep right there, some ice. Speaking of the girls, let's go check them out. I put that heat lamp in to keep them warm. And I put some hay down. But the, that rain and everything, just it just beat it down over here. So, hey my girls. Mac said hello, by the way. Y'all say hello to Mac. Blah, 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 blah. They're eating uh, some of the uh, cauliflower uh, leaves right now. They enjoy that. So, I had to play Chase the Chicken the other day. And uh, Mick, yeah, it wasn't too bad though. I was able to use those um, treats and I shook the bag and I was like the Pied Piper and uh, they followed me. So, um, yeah, there's the girls there. They made it overnight with the heat lamp. Okay, I think that's about it. I, um, a couple of my kale plants right there. They're making it. I wish they'd grow a lot taller so I can start eating them. Uh, Rose right there is still going. There's another one about to bud. So, Rose, garlic, chamomile right there. Garlic's just uh, doing this thing very slowly, very limited. I do have some eggplant right here, actually, and I'm going to try to see about having that grow. I have a large eggplant uh, as well. I'm going to have that uh, inside, maybe a little greenhouse out here. Uh, it's weird that we had this cold weather. Uh, normally we don't have it uh, this cold, but uh, whatever. So, anyway that's it thanks very much for watching this fall garden update and uh, if there's anything you want to see anything you want to hear just uh 
leave commentary down below. You can also email me, strawhatvideo at gmail.com. All right, these greens. Miss Linda, you have a recipe? Shoot me an email, please, and uh, let me know when to harvest these if I need to wait uh, until they're defrosted or take care of them now. Okie dokes. Thanks for watching. This is Grow Me Something, Mr. And remember... Uh, no, still don't have an exit line yet, so see you later, everybody.